Down here on the backside of our property today, I've got the lake here just behind me, our little makeshift boat ramp that we've put in. Um, oh, probably a good 10 years ago we, we put it in and um, just to put the jet skis in this spot during summer and stuff, just to have some good times. But over the past few months, I've been tossing up if I should put a fridge in the back of my Polaris just for when I'm going around the property. Just be really cool to have some, um, some cold drinks and stuff in there while we're yeah out ripping around the property. So thank you so much to the guys at Bushman. They've actually sent me what I was considering buying anyway. They've actually sent me out a roadie. So the little roadie fridge is basically like a console replacement. And it was actually what I was considering buying anyway for the back of the Polaris, because I just wanted a small little fridge, nothing too big, have a dozen drinks in there and whatnot, a couple of, I don't know, maybe some twiggy sticks and stuff like that. And, um, yeah, just something to snack on while you're cruising around the property. So they've sent me this. So grateful. Thank you, guys. Really appreciate it. And, yeah, let's get into unboxing this thing. And I want to I check it out. I'm keen. So let's get into unboxing this bad boy. So very well insulated when she comes to you in the, in the mail. Got the fridge just here. So I'll try and lift it out of this uh, this here box. Just put the box down on the ground. Wow. Wow, guys, that is a bloody nice fridge, eh? If you were to replace your console with that, that's that's pretty fancy. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I'm kind of a bit, a bit speechless. Like, it's all metal casing. Wow, that is a really nice fridge. Got some uh, sneakies in here. Mrs. must have snuck them in there for me. Good old Matzo's ginger beer. Got some great northerns. We've got all the accessories inside the fridge, so I'll just take these beauties out. Oh, sick. So we've got a canvas cover here for the fridge. That's awesome. That is sweet. What else have we got? It's just a handle. It's a handle or a strap or... I guess I'll have to read the instructions, but... What else we got? So you look, looks like we've got some mounting hardware here and your uh, owner's manual certificate of authenticity from the guys at Bushman. We've got some fridge straps here. I can't get over the quality of this. This is like I'm not just saying this because I received the fridge and and they sent it to me, but um. They are some of the best looking straps for holding down these because these you get a lot of these straps with these style of fridges or the um, even the the basic uh, chest style fridges, but they are really good high quality straps. And then we've got our um, our power cable with the uh, cigarette lighter. So I give you a better shot of the fridge, but um, that's magnetic. The lid is, and they are some seriously nice stainless hinges right there. Like they are never gonna break. It's all uh, metal cabinetry inside. The outside's all metal. It's all vented here at the front. Nice big Bushman logo there on the side. It's the same on the other side. I can't believe how nice this fridge is. I want to put this in the Raptor. 
Let's turn him around. Got this nice little dial here that goes from off to starts at 12 degrees, goes all the way down to minus 18. So that way you can select how cold you want your, your drinks. Got a cool little couple of cup holders just there. Nice little Bushman logo there in chrome. Nice venting here at the front. That'll help keep that. That'll help keep that cool. You got your uh, your DC 12. Oh sweet! It's 24 volt too. 12 or 24 volt. I'm I'm speechless. <laughs> I can't believe they sent me this fridge. How nice is it, guys? So good. I wonder how many cans you can fit in there. But this would be perfect if you've got like a, I don't know, a patrol or a Land Cruiser or something like that for lunch. Like if you don't, if you don't want to carry all your camping gear all the time, just for lunch time, going to work and stuff, having your lunch in your own fridge. Like if you've already got a dual battery system in your truck, but you don't carry your, your big camping fridge all the time and you've got just the standard console, I would be swapping it out for this bad boy. No hesitations. So I want to get this cover open and check this cover out. This is, I think this is too good to go in the back of the Polaris, guys. We've got a nice insulated cover there, so it goes, let's go that way. <laughs> How good does that look? Nice little cover on there. You've got handles here, so you can actually pick it up and super light, guys. So that's the cans inside the fridge. Got the good old liquid gold and the good old liquid bronze. So just looking through this pack here, you've got uh, some rubber feet. Um, so I think I've got a screwdriver in the in the Polaris. I might put those rubber feet on now. Yeah, so you got four rubber feet and you got the screws and stuff in there as well. And then I'm not too sure what this is. A couple of brackets. So these might be for your straps. These must go at each end like that. So you've just got to mark them and then drill them if you want to if you wanted to add them in. So you could you could have this all built into a nice uh, center console, and you maybe you don't want to have something big and bulky hanging off that. So Bushmen have given you the option to either fit it yourself or just have it nice and smooth with nothing nothing on there like we have just here. So I think that's cool. But yeah, a little bit of DIY. Basically, just drill them out. Instructions are here. So you've got two times 25 millimeter saddles, you've got eight sheet metal screws, and then you just got to drill a three mil pilot hole, mark it out, drill them, put the screws in, and then you've, you can use the strap like that, or you can use the tie downs to tie it down to your vehicle. Um, but guys, this fridge is so nice. Like I'm not just saying this because I've got the fridge. Um, none of my reviews are ever biased. I always tell it how it is. So I'm actually pretty keen to uh, get this thing cooling down. Well, I've got, I've got the chainsaw here. I'm going to be doing some um, little bit of tidying up and stuff here um, for camping next weekend. So I'm going to get this thing cooling down. So that way, when I start driving out of here, I'm going to have some nice cold drinks. So again, you've seen it in past videos, the Bain Tech 135 amp hour AGM. I love that product. It is so cool. That is my go-to for mobile power if I ever need some. So basically we're just gonna plug the fridge in. Plug it straight into the uh, socket here. Fridge turns on. Little blue light flashing. Let's go around to uh, I'd say zero, we'll go to zero degrees, get those beers nice and cold. The compressor just kicked in. I actually put, had to put my ear up against it to actually hear it. 
super quiet. That is awesome, especially inside your vehicle. If you're not listening to music, you're not listening to anything, you're just driving, last thing you want to hear is a compressor motor running. So that would be perfect for inside your vehicle. You can't even hear that running. Super quiet, guys. But yeah, let's see how long it um, takes to get down to temp. And we can... I gotta go do some work first, then I get to drink cold beer. So I'm gonna go do that. I'll, I'll be back with you soon. All right, so it's been about an hour. Just been chopping down trees and stuff and um, just trying to clean up some of the track coming down here. It's all overgrown. So let's uh, see how it's, see how the Bushman's going. Ooh, yeah. Oh yeah, they're cold. They are cold. Very cold. This is sick. <laughs> I love this fridge. Perfect situations like this. Down on the property, doing some work. I just bring me a uh, 135 amp hour battery. Bring me little fridge and uh yeah hard work ain't so hard honestly guys i'll give you a an update in a few months and um yeah let you know how it's going but very nice quality very very happy with it again just disclosure the guys from bushman they sent me this out i guess they appreciated my video i did on the upright because i loved it so much but um yeah thank you again to bushman fridges and yeah check it out the uh little bushman roadie very high quality little fridge all right guys i'm gonna go up now and i gotta go get the tractor and um just bring the mower down and just mow some grass over the back over here getting ready for camping next weekend so heaps of videos to come next weekend i'm gonna do lots of videos next weekend of uh camping and if you guys that are stuck at home and can't go anywhere, you can uh, enjoy camping down here with me for the weekend. So anyway, I'm going to finish this. I'm going to chuck the chainsaw back in the Polaris and head up and get the tractor. And I'll talk to you guys probably, yeah, next week. See you. I wonder if I can put this in the tractor. Probably could. I'm gonna try and put it in the tractor.